Well, hello there and welcome once again from uh, makingmoneyfromjunk.com. I am going to be sending my stuff off to the refiner today. Our, well, as soon as I can get it all together, got an awful lot of stuff in collecting it and doing it. Uh, now, I don't refine things myself. Don't recommend that you do that. There's a lot of work and it's very dangerous uh, using very, very dangerous chemicals. I highly recommend finding yourself a refiner that will take all of your gold scrap and uh, things and they'll refine that and bring you, send you back the gold. Now, here's some things that I'd had, uh, some that I'm getting ready to go. I've cleaned these up. You can see they're nice and neat. Uh, they are still on the plastic. He told me that that's okay. I, I contacted my refiner, and he said it was okay. You need to talk to yours to see how they might work with that. Uh, these things had some big brass fittings on them at the ends. Uh, some of them had some extra plastic. And so here's all that extra scrap I've popped off of there. And then this will go in my, my brass bin or my plastics bin, and I'll use that to refine. But they came out pretty nice, so this will be the stuff that he'll use, and he can really get a, a nice idea of that. Now, what else have we got? Well, we've got some a little piece of jewelry there. We've got some uh, uh, all kinds of little parts and pieces, and uh, some more jewelry. I don't know, all kinds of things in here. And this goes out by the way. These are little parts that I've been picking up. And you'll see off the videos, uh, this is the kind of stuff that I've got there. Uh, this is a piece here that's that's 24 karat, real nice and thick on there. Um, some military grade stuff, some chips. Uh, here's even a, a a fake Rolodex. How's that? Bought that the other day, and um, so he's going to try to take that one. There's some pieces here like this that I'm going to send him that are real nice gold inside. But I couldn't get the little board out of there. Couldn't figure out what to do. So he'll just have to melt that down. He'll melt the gold off of there. And then um, the rest of the big block of stainless will just be his because I won't, I won't get that back. Anyway, I've got in here some great big backplane boards that have a lot of gold on them. The other side is actually, I don't know if we can see it there, but yeah, get a pretty good idea. Got lots of gold on there. Uh, some of these boards have an awful lot of gold connectors on them and everything. Um, just all kinds of stuff I've been gathering for this last oh, few weeks anyway. And lots of different boards. There's a few cell phone boards. I don't I do not do a lot of those. I usually sell cell phones off. But um, if I buy them, somebody brings in cell phone boards, then I go ahead and keep those. So he's going to go ahead and uh, do all the refining out of this. There's here's even a uh, broken Pentium chip. So uh got that in somewhere and so I'm gonna have him just refine that. Anyway, lots of good stuff. I'm gonna be heading off to the refiner. I will respond to this video when when uh, once I get the uh the gold back. So keep watching this space and you'll find out how much gold we really did get out of all this stuff. I uh, also will be sending him I've got about five pounds of of fingers these gold fingers. Uh, I've got a lot of those, so I'm going to send those to him. I've got some uh, Pentium chips. Well, I'm, I didn't have everything out ready for the video, but hey, I wanted you to just know that it's going off to the refiner. There's a bunch of stuff, and um, it's really going to come out to be gold. So we'll see you soon. Thanks to everybody buying the uh, book, the ebook at makingmoneyfromjunk.com. Lots of good comments about that, and people out there learning how to make a whole lot of money instead of just this hobby stuff. I mean, this is fun, but uh, the bigger money is in the other stuff. I will be making a video real soon on that. So watch this channel. Thanks a lot. See you soon.